Are the locusts in Joel 1 the same as in Revelation 9? Yeah. To answer uh, Paul's question, uh, the Joel 1 locusts, no, they're real. Uh, they're actually, if you read Joel 1, it, it has, the Hebrew words are all the stages of a locust life. Uh, it's very interesting that it talks about the, the, actually the gazams, you know, all these different Hebrew words. So Joel 1 was a literal locust plague, if you read in Joel. But then what he said is those locusts are very much like fearsome future events. And when we get to Revelation 9, these are not locusts. These are actually demon creatures. And the way we know that is, the way we know that Revelation 9 are not literal uh, plague of insects is because of several reasons. In Revelation 9, they're down in a pit, a spiritual holding tank for rebellious uh, uh, demons. They also have a spiritual, you know, Abaddon uh, or Apollyon, uh, a demon that is uh, over them. And, and locusts do not have a king. It already says that in the, in the book of Proverbs that, you know, the locust has no king. So these are demon creatures that are imprisoned there and that are allowed out and that they do their havoc. These were real locust insects, but they were figurative of the future uh, revelation-type judgments. And, and just like the uh, horsemen, uh, you know, and the hair and everything else are all figurative descriptions that we see in Revelation 9. 